814, 10 on your side is your local election headquarters. We are exactly two weeks away from Election Day. As we prepare you to head to the polls, we're taking a look at a few specific races of interest in Hampton Roads. And this week, we introduce you to those looking to replace the man who currently holds the title as the longest continually serving council member in Hampton Roads. 10 on your side's Brett Hall reports from Norfolk. For three decades, those living in some of the more southwestern portions of Norfolk, including some of the region's more economically challenged neighborhoods, have been represented by the same man, Councilman Paul Riddick. He will leave City Council at the end of the year. Now three men vying for his seat. Today we introduce you to one of them. My name is John J.P. Page, and I'm running for City Council in the City of Norfolk for Ward 4. Page, an Air Force veteran turned bail bondsman, says the reason he decided to throw his hat in the ring? That I could be the person that would be a bridge to allow for leadership that's present to get to know people that I don't think they know anymore. We asked him if that should be meant as a criticism of the current city council. I would say the city council could be a whole lot better. He says he doesn't agree with recent city council efforts that shut down nightlife operations in the name of tackling crime. And while he has the endorsement of his predecessor, he says he will do things differently than Riddick. Riddick has had his fair share of controversies over the years, often sparring with other council members. Critics say it has hurt Ward 4. I think my ability to connect with all people and get along with people in certain ways and to be mission oriented and mission focused will allow for us to get some things done that traditionally we had challenges in getting done. His top concern, addressing the violence. His plan. Dealing with people that traditionally we haven't dealt with. We have so many stop the violence rallies that don't include any people that are violent. How we're going to address the issue if we're preaching to the choir? He says he's about having one-on-one -on -one conversations. Hey, hey, good morning, sir. He What's says up, each change starts with one person. And when it comes to the one place he loves most in Norfolk. I have a passion for fishing. There are a couple of secret fishing holes that are downtown. He'd like to bring charter fishing boats to the Elizabeth River. Then he could show us and visitors where they are, maybe. In Norfolk, Brett Hall, 10 on your side. To read Paige's full candidate profile, you can find it on our voter guide on wavy.com. We'll introduce you to other candidates in the race later this week.